And we're live! Oh, let's mute that. There we go. There we go. <laughs> uh, welcome to Zero Page Homebrew Friday Edition. And you can hear me and you can hear the game too, but we don't want that just yet. It's in the background, but... Um, so today we're going to be playing Star Castle Arcade as part of the homebrew tournament that's, that's being right. hosted by Lid Likes and Television nice. on the Atari Age forums. Mm -hmm. And it's the 31st today, which means it's the last day of competition. Excellent. So it fell just perfectly today. <laughs> but this game is really hard. Okay. And there's some high scores out there. Okay. So we have to figure out some strategies on how to play this game. And it doesn't help that I have never played this game before, so... <laughs> uh, maybe sometimes can, it does help you bring a fresh some perspective. I can suggestions, but yeah, no, I don't know this game, so... <laughs> um, but let's get to some book, some, some, some information first, actually. Okay. Housekeeping. Um, housekeeping, that's yes. the word I'm looking for. <laughs> Something house? Yeah. Yes. Um, thank you for... Oh, actually, yes, I post a... I supposed to is wearing the same shirt as I am apparently. Yeah. <laughs> now I wore this because it's very related to the look of Star Castle. Mm. The enemy you're trying to defeat is in the middle of a bunch of circles and you have to shoot through the circles to destroy the enemy in the middle. Mm -hmm. And I thought this t-shirt looks exactly like the game. <laughs> so that's very perfect. Nice. And he told me there are circles involved, so I made sure I had round earrings on. Yes, yeah, so we're on theme today. Yeah, that, that's the best trying, I can do <laughs> with short notice. Trying to be on theme. Yeah. Um, and I want to thank the Twitch subscribers yes. that are supporting the show. Mm -hmm. And we there's a ton coming in now, actually. Really? That's super yeah. awesome. <laughs> so um, I want to thank Carcass, Adaman, Tiki Dank, it's not Tiki Dank. It's Tiki, Tiki Dan K. Tiki Dan K. And you can all out there guess who Tiki Dan K is <laughs> from the last week's announcement. Um, soundtrack underscore 78, Mr. Fix, Jeffrey 2123, and three new subscribers mm. since last episode two days ago. Nice. Uh, a Tasty Sandwich, uh, Atari Spot, who's in the chat tonight. And ground underscore ground trooper. I don't need to pronounce underscores. It's probably because they somebody already took ground trooper. Yes. And they yeah. you know had to keep it ground trooper. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, if you're a um, subscriber to Amazon Prime, you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch Prime and click subscribe, and it costs you nothing and it supports the channel. And I will thank you for it yes. on the channel. Yeah. And uh, some people are chatting already. I had a little bit of difficulty getting the stream going because mm -hmm. I upgraded the streaming software like an hour before the show. Oh, that Never might... do that. I was going to say that, that that's... It's bad news. <laughs> Never upgrade your software no. right before using the software. Yeah. No, I was... I thought, oh, good. Uh, it's going to be better. Asking for trouble. Yeah. yeah, so I couldn't get the video <laughs> camera going till like five minutes before the show. Mm, okay. So that's probably why there's not a lot of people kind of chatting yet because... It's been out of commission <laughs> for, <laughs> to, for five minutes, to the yeah. last five minutes. But uh, I suppose is there in Atari spot, and I'm sure a lot of people are there as well, just not chatting. Mm -hmm. um, but I want to thank all the hundreds of subscribers, not subscribers, hundreds of people that are Follow following us. on yeah. all the social media mm -hmm. out there and all the people watching the show today. And I have a box to open today. Very nice. It's, I'm pretty sure it's nothing to do with Atari, but it is to do with video <laughs> games, so I thought I'd do it on the show. Why not? It's, it's fun to do it on the show. Um, but before we get to that... What? I'm just looking. <laughs> before we get to that, I have a big non-announcement <laughs> to make. Um, there's a big game exclusive coming very shortly to Zero Page Homebrew. Very shortly, I've been told, weeks away, okay. that you will be seeing it on the show. Um, and I was past the binary file, the work in progress of this game, yesterday, and I was playing it, and it is amazing. It's really good. It's lots of fun. And so they'll be making the announcement, I think, in days, maybe? Mm. Very shortly. They said 
they said very shortly, very soon, they'll make a public announcement of the game with some screenshots. And then after that, there's a little bit more work to be done before they're ready to pass it on to me for the show to do the exclusive preview of it on the show. Very exciting. So we're getting a whole bunch of exclusive previews Excellent. on Zero Page, and Excellent. it's lots of fun. That is very exciting. Um, so yeah, I can't really, I can't say yet what the game is, unfortunately, because mm -hmm. I've been sworn to secrecy. But it is fun, and uh, yeah, I can't say anything. <laughs> I was going to say something else. <laughs> oh, I, and and it's not just the game. There's something more to it as well. Okay. There's more than just a game. So, but I can't say that anything about that either, because it'll give a hint away. So now let's get to the box. Yeah, that, that was a very good non non announcement. Non announcement. It's a huge non announcement. <laughs> a huge non non announcement. Not oh my god, I can't even say it. Too much wine or not enough. Not enough yet. <laughs> okay. So let's open the box now. All right. Let's see what this is. I think I know what this is. Actually, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's dangerous. And it's from um, the UK. The UK. Yeah. See uh, an old version of uh, the Queen. The Queen looking younger than she is now. Yeah. I don't think they'd ever. On a sticker on the top. <laughs> put a picture of her as she is now on anything. No, no, they do. They've do they? updated. Oh, yeah. Oh no, they? her her likeness has been updated on all of our lovely coinage here in Canada. So <laughs> That's right. uh, they do change it. It does change up every once in a while. Oh wow. I mean, she still looks pretty flawless. But... Say no more. Say no more. I supposed to say <laughs> yes. I will say no more. <laughs> Let's see what this is. Ooh, it looks fancy. Ooh. It is a game for the Vectrex. Nice. It is Stramash Zone. Stramash? Stramash. Stramash? How Stramash? would you say that? Stramash. 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 And this is, obviously, if you take a look at the cover, it is a Vectrex version of Battle Zone. And that was another vector game in the arcade. And what better home for it to be put on than the Vectrex. Than the Vectrex. And it looks super nice, which is why I did buy it. Um, because I do have a bunch of Vectrex games. And I do buy Vectrex homebrew from time to time when it looks really good. Mm. Um, there's a lot of homebrew made for Vectrex. So I can't, I can't keep up. This is a terribly expensive hobby. <laughs> The to Vectrex? buy video games yeah. and Vectrex in, in particular. Um, but uh, just like I don't buy every Atari 2600 homebrew, mm. I just I buy a lot of them, but not everyone because I would just go broke buying them all. But uh, they sent it in a nice box. Usually I put it the other way around where the flap is on the back so you can see the full... Well, you can probably, you can oh, probably flip, it, flip around. it around. Yeah. I mean, they, they yeah. So that's this program that's nice by stuff. James G. Watt and uh, from the UK. From the UK. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Made in the UK. And there's no regions on this because it's all vectors. Has nothing to do yeah. with anything. <laughs> oh, I suppose to says he bought that too. <laughs> so I'll have to try that soon enough. What did they but... say great minds think alike. Exactly. Yeah. Well, it looked like a really nice game, so I expect it to sell really, really, really well. well. Cool. I have a bunch of other Vectrex games coming. I have to pull out too. the Vectrex sometime soon. Yes. Yeah. Well, I haven't played that in a while. No. And I just I work. looked up to where the Vectrex is. Vectrixes? Vectrix, Vectrix oh my goodness. Vectri? Vectri? And the Vectri are. We yes. have two yes. on, on a high me, shelf that you can't see. Way up there. Um, but unfortunately, they're right by the lights and, and uh, just a bell blind myself. Burning our retinas. So that's fine. But yeah, we'll have to pull them down sometime. Yes. Yeah. It's been a while. Pop in the new games. Yeah. Um, so we're now we're going to get to the game. Okay. And we're competing for some very high scores. Okay. The highest score, of course, yeah. is by the person who's running the tournament. He happened to pick all games that he's really good at. Maybe he's <laughs> just really good at Atari 2600 Well, he games. is. That's for sure. Yeah. Like, he eclipses everyone. Like, it's pretty close on this one. A little bit closer. So, his the top score is 24,530. That's what he has. Wow. Okay. And it goes all the way down to 2,660. That's... Okay the people on the board right now. Gotcha. Um, my score last time was 9,740. Okay. So. Mm, I see Erlen, Erlen's name on there too. Yeah. He comes just, just below you there. Just below yeah. me at 9,190. I would like to get 15,000. That would be nice to get into fourth place. Mm. It may or may not happen. 
it's a tough game. <laughs> You'll see. Fair enough. This is probably the the hardest one so far okay. in the tournament that in terms of my relative skill to everyone else's. It's, it's, it's a hard game in general. Um, so let's uh, flip over to the game. And something weird happened today when I put the game in. Mm -hmm. You'll see in a second. Look at those scores. They're not even numbers, some of them. Look at like the third place. It's like a upside down H with an extra line through it or a backwards four. But what I'm seeing on, and again, you're you're seeing it being streamed, which looks a little different. We can see it through our computer monitor, but on yeah. the TV itself, the scores look like they look really strange. Are they crazy? Well, I'm going to explain that. Okay. This was also originally a vector game, vector based oh, that's game. That's why they had it has that vector look to it. So when you draw two lines that intersect on a vector. Mm -hmm. Um, you can draw it in two ways. You can go like this, then this, or you can draw it independently. But at some point, it's going to have to either sit at one spot or overlap on one spot. And where those two sections in, uh, meet, it's going to be more intense of a light. And what they've done, cl super cleverly, mm. the programmers of this, have made that little intersection just a little bit brighter. So it gives the look of the So it the gives vector. the look of a vector-based okay, drawing cool. of letters nice. and numbers. It's super brilliant. It's amazing. Um, so that's why it looks really strange and, and a little hard to make out. But that, like, look at the bottom. Doesn't mm -hmm. that look like vectors? Mm -hmm. Like it's been drawn perfect straight lines, yeah. everything. Struck. I'm not sure. It, it seems more pronounced on the screen we're watching it on than it does on the stream. It's very hard to tell. It's different. Yeah, it is a little it. different, but yeah. um, hopefully that comes across. Yeah, so let's turn up the volume. <laughs> Drexel up. says, but why does that make the scores wrong? Oh. No one really knows. It's just looking really weird. Okay, that's another thing. <laughs> Yeah, so when I turned it on, look, there's a negative score. Negative 71,604 in fifth place. I did put a score in there at the bottom just to say, make sure that it uh, does actually record the scores. Mm. Uh, oh, Is you can reset your game's high score area on your Atari Vox. We'll wipe out your scores, but not all the other saves game scores. How do I do that? Without wiping out any of the other scores. Just this game, because I, I haven't memorized. Because you have to hold down like um, reset when you turn on your system or something like that or a button or something can are you supposed to can you let me know which button it is so but wouldn't can... that wipe out just yours not the others no that it are should there? reset everything to the defaults well wipe your scores but not all the other save games i don't care about my score no but the other save game scores like so... all the other games that i played like wall jump ninja scores will go. Oh, I don't on the want Atari that. Vox. Oh, I see. Atari I Vox. It's, yeah, 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 yeah. It okay. saves scores yeah. and outputs. Gotcha. gotcha. I would like to do that because you can't beat some of those scores. They're negative numbers. They're crazy. They're insane. Just so we can. Uh, but when. Yeah, that's a bit strange. Yeah, I want to reset them. Can't you automatically beat a negative score? <laughs> Shouldn't that happen? Something's weird with there's those. There's something weird something, going on Look there. at those. Like, and then there's like 20,000 with a space in it. That's <laughs> very strange. Scores don't have spaces. Yeah. Read the manual. Should be in the manual. I don't want to post any <laughs> <laughs> uh, Oh, For uh, the Atari Vox, maybe. Ooh. Uh, yeah, it may not be in this manual. Oh, the Atari Vox manual. I can't Lord say. Lord Monkus says, LOL, chicken. Chicken? Chicken? To reset the scores? Yes, I am. Because I have a world record on Wall Jump Ninja that you do not want to get rid of. So yes, I am very chicken. <laughs> Let's see if it's in the manual of Star Castle. Just before we start. Actually, you can you can practice if you want. Right now. I've never played this game, so this should be fun. Considering okay. you, you tell me how hard it is to play. So. so I'll give you the controls. What am I doing? Left and right to turn. Oh, okay. Forward to go forward like thrust it's like asteroids left and right you turn your oh, ship no. okay <laughs> yeah one of those yeah one of those <laughs> and then button fire. to fire that's it and what you have to do is shoot the rings the protective rings but don't shoot every piece of every ring because it'll be rebuild that ring up again and those little oh, dots I see. those little dots are mines that are going to come out and get you so you need to shoot them or get oh, away from them i have to move forward yes I get you. Okay. And then you have to shoot that guy. As soon as you make a... 
an opening in the inner ring, he will shoot through it and kill you. Ah! Gotcha. So, Atari Vox. Ah, ha, ha. Uh, I, bet I, I bet it won't talk about the Atari Vox, because it's not its job to talk about ah! the Atari Vox. Oh my goodness. Here. One. Oh, well, you blasted an opening. Now you just have to shoot him through the opening. I, the problem is, yeah, I, I get, I get the will, difficulty. Yeah, you have to be moving. You have to be moving because he will st lock into you and shoot when he can. Gotcha. And he will shoot. So and then how you, do I reset? Just press one. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to look up Atari Box information. Oh no. To reset all of the saved scores, hold the joystick right, and then press fire during the Atari Age startup screen. Okay, okay. So we will do that right after your game. Oh, that was interesting. You... Oh, that's interesting. Oh. You found a little cheat. Yes, I did. I'm not sure I can he actually was, make it work. He was aimed at you, but he'd still fire at you. Oh. That's the problem. Because you were at the bottom, mm -hmm. but firing at him through the top. Ah, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm doing terribly because I'm <laughs> I'm trying to figure out the movement of the ship. That was interesting. Was he, was there an ah, opening for him or I, was he closed off? This is making me crazy. <laughs> sorry, no, it's it's the movement, the fact that... You can't just move left, right, up, down. Yeah, and I'm just not used to that. Oh no, they come back! Yeah, when you shoot the last piece of the ring, it reforms the ring, so don't shoot the last piece of the ring. Because then you have to shoot it all again. Not much point. Okay, so we will wait until you are done. Your game. And we'll reset the scores. Are you just shooting all the rings? <laughs> okay. 2,000. <laughs> You're gonna, so you're gonna... hold right and the button while hold I turn what? this on. Hold right? Right and the button. Got it. Yeah. Keep holding it. There we go. Oh, there we go. Go up and press the button. Awesome. So wait. Let's see the scores. Let's see what they are. Oh, completely wiped out. Not even the default scores. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Do you want me to play or you want to go again? One more time. One more time. Okay. I'm, I'm getting a feel for this. This is this is definitely a difficult game. Oh, yeah. Bye bye, Wall well, Jump Ninja. <laughs> yeah. No, it's not. No, no, no. Bye bye, Wall well, Jump Ninja. No. no, no. Only this game, Wall. Well, this game, right? Uh oh. Too late now. <laughs> I have it recorded, but I'm gonna freaking me out. And he's laughing. I'm going to look this up. <laughs> Maybe I did ah. delete everything. It implied in the manual that only these ga this these uh, high scores will be reset. Because that looked like a menu within Star Castle, not a general oh. Atari Vox. And this is Atari, the cat. You going to settle down between us? Hi. I'm not very good at this game. Atari Vox. Oh, tail in my way. Atari Vox score reset. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure you have to like hold down something on the console itself. Uh, Atari Vox. Oh, I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get how you you get this guy. You have to sh shoot an opening in his ring, and then you have to go around to the other side of the screen, line up with that opening, and shoot through it before he turns around to your side. Because he goes oh, kind of... Oh, I see. He goes very slowly. He turns very slowly. I need to do this again. Sorry. Where's the Atari Vox manual? Eternity. Yeah. Great thing is you're 
reset and fire, reset and up, both reset and select while on high score menu, etc. Oh. Lord Monka says, nah, it looked like it was only for that game. I still want to look it up. I'm, st I'm, I'm freaking out here. Can anybody find an actual link? The manual? Because I don't know where my manual is. It's somewhere buried far away. Nope. Nope. Can't get blame, up there. I will blame that death on uh, Pixel. See, see, now you've got an opening, so you have to yeah. get on the side. Oh my goodness. Again, <laughs> You're spinning to, in a circle. It's because I'm trying to go left and right. <laughs> I, I'm just not used to that um, that style of movement. I'm not very good at, at uh, navigating it. Okay. Well, I'm going to believe... I can't find it. I can't find the instructions. I'm going to believe that I didn't delete my high score. I hope. And uh, we'll just go with that for now. So you've got an opening. Yeah, that's a good way to do it. Is to... No, he's right at you. I know. He can't sit. I know. Yeah. He it's terrible. He will kill you before you kill him. Or you may kill each other. Which is not the best way to do it. You do get a free life every level you complete. Because it's so hard. That's the right that's a that's a good strategy though. Is zooming by him, but it's it's hard to time up. <laughs> um, I'm there just is so not used to the movement. There is another strategy that you can do. Is bouncing left and right directly horizontal to him. Well that's interesting. Try that one. No, well, you're not quite close enough. You have to be like in the center to do that. To shoot the center ring, yeah. Yeah. Um, so I supposed to sent me a bunch of info um, from since uh, the last time we played this game on the stream about two weeks ago when we put in our first high scores. Oh my goodness. Um, at the end of 2011, around mid-December, somebody started a thread, what's the deal with Star Castle? Asking about the 8K Scott Williamson strange situation. The fourth or fifth post is me asking for somebody to throw everything at it and do it right. This is how you supposed to say this. The next page of that thread, CDW posted a kernel ring demo using only one player. T, that's your name? Oh, you're going to go again? Yeah, oh yeah, okay. if, you're if you're talking. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, uh, CDW posting a kernel ring demo using only one player. And that's that's like the hardest part of this game, is that that ring, to draw that ring. Circles on an Atari? Mm -hmm. I guess it's no, no harder than anything else, because lines, circles, anything. Are you going to be trouble? Come over here. Don't be trouble over there. Um, that's why I say I caused Star Castle Arcade to become a real cart slash game. So he, so I supposed to say he was, he, um, kind of prompted people to rethink wh how it could be done. Um, I, I just, had just joined Atari aged late 2011. Um, so he, this was right after he joined. I only made suggestions to Star Castle Arcade and play tested and reported bugs to Thomas. Also, my first game credit was the suggestion in Space Rocks that turned into Friction on Off. Being in space, you keep going, I said. Uh, Stay Frosty 2, Stay Froster DPC plus Christmas Music was the first project I helped in a large way. That's all I supposed to. Remember, asking to have games made usually never goes anywhere because people code what they like. Yeah, exactly. You can't just throw a bunch of, you know, suggestions out there and expect games to be made because it takes years years for these games to be made because it's these aren't people's jobs to make these games they have other nine to five jobs oh it was a little mine they, oh is that what got came me off yeah it was it was hard to see but they're all flickery on the on there are you gonna be trouble come here come here pixel come on up oh, oh come on there we go and this is pixel the other kitty there was a thread on Atari Age 
um, group on Facebook asking what you would name your cat in related related to Atari. Yeah. And of course, I said, we did it! <gasps> yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> Sorry. <yeah. laughs> Awkward, too close. Yeah. Um, and I said, well, I'd name my cat Atari. Because I have a cat Atari. And the other one, Pixel. Uh, also, you need one of these Starplex controllers. Yeah. I don't know if that would be easier or harder. Um, there's these controllers with just buttons. So it would be left, right, thrust, and fire. Gotcha. But you'd, ah! have, but you'd have four buttons. That'd be that'd be difficult. I think that'd be more difficult than a joystick and buttons. You're gonna be trouble. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Pixel likes to crawl all over the, the electrical equipment and press buttons. And sometimes that turns on and off sounds. Is the audio loud enough for the game? I'll turn up a little bit. There we go. Um, they sometimes show up on eBay, but I won't port pay more than $35, and now I have more than I need. Hey, I own this one. Um, okay, by the end of the first week in January 2012, CDW had a playable Star Castle. So that was like a couple weeks. Wow, he put into it like a month, two months. He blogged below, documented the whole thing up to September 2012 when it could, it could be deemed done. Wow, it only took about a year to make this game. Uh, oh, but then Thomas Yench took it over at that point. Thomas improved it over the years to the masterpiece that it was uh, to the masterpiece that was released. Uh, okay, my turn. I need to get some practice in. So 4360 nah. on Castle Two. Getting there. Getting there. <laughs> takes a lot of practice. Well, and the movement is, if you're not used to that, and to be honest, I don't play oh, I mean, this style of game where you're turning left and right and thrusting forward, Yeah. I mean, uh, certainly a lot of older games and arcade games do that, but oh, very yeah. few games do that now, so. Almost no, it's, modern, it's, oh, yeah. no modern games do that. Yeah, so I mean, that makes it very challenging for sure. You did, you were able to figure out that you can shoot the mines? Yes. Well, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think that's something that needs a little bit of practice. So, the tactic that I was... Psst. No, 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 no. Can you watch the cat? What is he doing? He's looking. <laughs> I, know he's what he's, <laughs> I know what he's thinking. When I... when Because he's a bad cat. <laughs> he likes to get up... Oh, electrical equipment. Mm -hmm. He may need to be kicked out. Mm. Mm. Yeah, he's going up. Ugh. Okay, you have to shut the door. <laughs> he's flopped under a table now. Now he's hiding. Yeah. He's like, no, he's I'm like, not doing no, anything. No, I know what you want to do. You want to kick me out of the room. It's not going to happen. Ah. And there's no time limit on this game. Yes, which so is, no is actually good. And you can uh, mash yourself into the... Um, He's going up on the mixing board. Can you kick him out and shut the door? He won't stop. I I died, but I defeated the castle. I'm getting attacked by a black and white cat right now. Yeah, he's not so happy about being kicked out. You're gonna show him off before you kick him out. Show him off before I throw him out. A little bit of cat torture. There's a little bit of cat fluff right there. Oh, he looks very annoyed. <laughs> very <laughs> upset. Oof, it's close. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yes, that is exactly the look. That is the look. That you just need to digitize this face. <laughs> oh, that's, I know. That's the annoyed look. I know. I know. The ears are subtly back. <laughs> He's waiting to lash out. Okay, now I've opened We're a so much trouble. portal to hell here. Ah! Oh. Ah! And you can't, you have to move immediately if you've yes. got a, yes. a ring open. Oh. Both of you. Oh. <laughs> Both of you. <laughs> He's like, what did I do? <laughs> I didn't do anything. No. Ah! Oh! oh.
Should I just put Zed? Whatever you want. Yeah! Boo! <laughs> it's so hard. It's so hard. <laughs> I'll never get 15,000. So the best tactic is to like open up, open the hole and then whole thing up as much as possible. Ah, oh, did I open? I think I opened a, a tiny little yep. portal. Oh, well, maybe not. I don't oh. know if he can he can necessarily shoot out of it if it's really small. Yeah, I don't think I opened up. One. Ah. Oh. Bad idea, because he's yeah. pointing right at me. You, d you can't open one up when he's already pointing at you. Because he'll just shoot and kill you. Oh, what did I bump into there? An invisible wall there. Apparently. Ah! Uh, what Lord, Lord, my oh! He doesn't wait for you. Automatically. Ah, oh, almost. Come on. Let's line it up. Get some strafing in. That's what you gotta almost do. Uh, almost, almost. Oh! oh. What did I bump into? There's like virtual walls there. You can't like get too close. Maybe it won't let you. Um, it won't let you run touch into him. him. Yeah. yeah. Okay, he's completely closed off now. Oh yeah, each part has to be hit twice. Each segment of the um, of the ring. Ding, ding, ding noises. Whoa! Whoa that, that was, was close. Very I close. didn't think you were going to survive that. Oh. Oh. I do think if you get too close and you smack into them when, when the rings are fairly empty, yeah. um, it will cause it to come back up. Oh, you mean it might cause destruction by just touching them? Like, like hitting, yeah, if you hit too close. Oh, good job! Woo! Good job! Is that, now that's, now pain. you're on two or you're on three? Two. You're on two. Yeah. How many lives did I have? So hard. So hard! I do like the color scheme. Yeah, it's very the nice. The different purples. purples. Yeah. yeah. Very good, very good. Pick. Good thing about the 2600, it has very, very nice colors. Yeah. 128 colors to choose from. I shouldn't open up that. Ooh, that was close. Open up little things yet. Oh. Oh. Thousand. That's pretty good. Yeah. Getting there. As long as I keep improving, I'm fine with that. Okay, let's see. So let's continue on with the stories. It uses a custom DPC bank plus bank switching kernel designed just for Star Castle. That's why some of the early builds end in .cu. To tell, Harm to tell Harmony Cart it is custom. Interesting. The DPC Plus chip is different than running code on the Harmony's ARM processor. Is different than running code. Oh, okay. Even though the ARM processor is emulating the DPC Plus chip. See, I it's all above my head. The, the, the ARM, ARM programming and DPC Plus chip. 
Last Night Me or the game? No. <laughs> no, neither? Uh, uh, no, uh, the game. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, Just, yeah. I'm, I'm playing around, sorry. He says, uh, <laughs> he says, I know it's hard to understand, but think of it this way. The games built with DPC Plus can do operations faster than plain assembly. Right. Because it's a chip inside the cartridge that's running at a faster um, clock speed than the Atari 2600 can run. Um, but Stella's emulation completely ignores Stella. Stella? Stella. Stella on the PC. Stella's emulation completely ignores all ARM DPC Plus code, and the games work in Stella emulation without ARM code at the beginning. That does not clear it up. No idea. Um, that's why you can play 28K DPC Plus games in Stella. It ignores the entire 4K ARM code and just runs NOP, no operation instructions, until the game come, comes back to using the 6507. There's ARM code and there's DPC Plus code. Uh, it's very confusing. And then there's, you know, the 6507 code that Atari runs natively. Um, did you do better? I'm trying to get okay? no, it was no. terrible. Terrible? <laughs> uh. You already know it doesn't use any coprocessor logic, but it all actually uses more processing power than can be done in one frame, like al most other games. Yes, how? Thomas wrote rudimentary multitasking system that lets unfinished calculate calculations finish up in later frames. Ah, I was wondering about that in programming um, the 2600 using these advanced processors, whether you can do multitasking, because some calculations I would expect would take more than one frame, some really complex ones. <clears throat> I suppose this says, I know a technique that the world record holder of Star Castle on Vectrex uses. It kind, it's kind of a, like a horizontal back and forth. I did see that and it, when I was researching the last time for playing, is that you, if you bounce back and forth horizontally, directly in line with the guy. Yeah. Well, uh, he has to move can, too. He has to move and turn around. It takes him a long time. So you have tons of time. But to do that, when you bounce off horizontally, it does turn your ship around, but not perfectly horizontal. So that when you bounce, you have to turn slightly a bit and then go forward again. But apparently it's the best way to do it because it's the shortest distance of travel. I guess you could do it top to bottom too. And that would be shorter distance. But maybe left and right is better because of the mines. It gives you more room to avoid the mines. Um, the source has always been on a server linked in a CDW blog post. Um, I was able to compile all the changes along the way between officially released versions. Very cool. Version 165 is the last released version with Thomas having both a Stella build and a Harmony build. I think something about different DPC plus header files and Harmony's original versus Harmony Encore problems. So there's a whole bunch of information that I don't understand about programming yeah. this game. Excellent. <sighs> Good job. And five ships, you didn't even lose one. Really? No, that's not possible. <laughs> you have five ships now. Oh, maybe you lost. I think you start out with five ships. Do you? Yes. I probably lost. I know I've you lost, lost at one least and one. You gained one. There's an even better back and forth way until the difficulty gets too high, then you need to never stop thrusting. Drexel says, nice shot. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and thanks for tuning in. Oh. Let's read a little bit about the game and all the Terrible. names of things in the game. Outer ring, middle ring, inner ring. And the middle is the star castle. So that's what the game was named after, is the guy in the middle. And it's a very nice artwork on, uh, I can't really hold it up without blocking your view, but very nice artwork on the, on the manual here. And it has like 
the star castle it looks like it looks like it's made of like crystal it looks amazing and all the rings are like bases yeah really really cool and you are just named you in this picture and there's uh, homing mines that's what those little dots are called oh good shot Save myself um, from being destroyed. So does it give you a name? Oh, I'm sure it does. Does back do anything on controls? I don't think it does. I think it's only thrust, so you can't really slow down. No, just left, right, and fire. And up. Um, three rings of rotating energy. Each ring consists of 12 segments that can be individually cleared when hit twice by your ship's missiles. Beware that completely eliminating the outer ring will cause the remaining energy rings to expand outwards. So they don't rebuild, they move up a bit. Mm. I thought they were rebuilding, so... Well, they kind of rebuild. They kind of, but they take the inner one and move out, so any rings that are destroyed in the inner one would just move mm. out. And then the very inner one is solid again. So if you've made any inroads <laughs> into shooting the inner ring, it just rebuilds. It just just yeah. bounces back. Yeah. So I think I should practice this technique when it's not too panicky. So the technique is this. See, then you turn. Yeah. Well, you, you bounce, bounce. You bounce and actually face back the opposite direction. Not not completely perfectly. No, but, but enough, close, close right? enough. And you watch how fast he turns. So if you go like this, and then you're shooting him, you have like a number of seconds before... Oh, of course, you don't want to be that close. <laughs> but it kind of be right here, so you have a fighting chance. Nope. Against the, the mines. And the mines move out on the rings, too, from the center. But I, I feel like... I don't know. What I was trying to do was when I got down to the inner ring. So now I'm in a good position. I would start moving. Yes. And you then have to. and then you try to shoot the inner ring while you're still moving. That's how you do it. Ah. Okay, because you can shoot a ring. You can shoot the ring and, and him, him at the same time. If you do time. it fast enough. That makes sense. There we go. That makes okay, sense. Okay, maybe I'll get some decent scores now. I doubt it. At least I've got a a technique. I had no technique before. A technique is better than that. See now, it's pretty good. So now if I do that again, nope. Well, you killed I too shot. much of one of the rings, yeah. but that's okay. I, you can kind of see how that tactic works. Ah. And the mine. <laughs> and the mine got me. How about a nice shot for me, Drexel? Okay. <laughs> no. 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 Just preferences for Tanya. <laughs> that's all. Oh, did I? Oh, I accidentally shot. No, he's got a. Spot open. Oh no. See, that's an issue. And then you have to keep moving. Yeah. I'm gonna try that technique though. But I have to bounce quick. Nope. It, it's all about the timing of it. Yeah. Because there's other rings getting in the way now. Oh no. Drexel said, I thought nice shot. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the thought that counts, right? Yeah. Is that the same? <laughs> no, no. The problem is these mines start getting crazy. Nice! You gotta I got get both, both at the same time. Just go boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Whether when there's a big opening. Ah, ah they're so fast now. Yeah. Some of these people are clearing like 10, 10 levels. That's amazing. Like, how do they survive? Oh, well, they so practice long. a whole heck of a lot. <laughs> but I'm look sure. at these mines. Relentless. Is that what they do? They just. Oh, Ooh, you got the inner. Ah, run! <laughs> run! Panic! It is panic time. Does he still have an opening? He does. Nope. Yes, he does. Oh. <sighs> Better. That was good. Better. And that's what counts. Oh, oh. oh. 
this is it. Yeah. It just takes too long, especially <laughs> when you're know, playing with two people passing it back and forth. Alright. It's just too much. Uh I sp oh whispered the tip to the channel is 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 it cheating to explain exchange gameplay tips? I don't think so. I mean you would watch um like it, it's cheating if it's a very cheaty move like you're cheating the game. Mm -hmm. Um but if it's like a strategy, you could get that from watching really Shit. good players. Um he says world record tip place your player horizontally at the edge of the screen, left or, ah! left or right side, but face away from. I gotta click to see it. Let's see what it says. But face away from the center so shots wrap and hit the rings. Horizontally at the edge of the screen. Blast until the mine ah! is coming. Tap to thrust to wrap around to the other side and shoot wrapping around. Ah. Oh my goodness. He's There's wide like open. You how did, how got did, him. How get did him. he get so Watch out. He's going to shoot immediately. Run, ah. run, run. <laughs> oh, he was wide open. That's rough. Okay, I need more wine. I'll be back. <laughs> okay. Oh, you had him. No, no, it's not so easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's try this little tip here. So I, I kind of understand about the mines, because they go after you. Like, so you can shoot the outer ring here. Can you shoot the inner ring from this? No. Can you? Oh, I think I can. And then you go like this. Oh, you can't even make it. At least not at this level. Got him anyway. Um, hmm. Can keep the door open now. Yeah. Till the, here? Till the oh yeah, till the cats well, figure it out. They can come down. They just can't be bad. They just can't <laughs> attack the soundboard. That's all. Can't climb all over the equipment pressing buttons. I was shooting. <laughs> ah. So his tip was to like do this for the mines because they whoa what they do chase you down though they do but they change directions they go directly for you so yeah. if you're like here I'll wait till one comes off Drexel is saying just stay on level one and shoot the mines because you do get points for the mines yeah oh. so you could you could just Doesn't get points, work but that would probably take quite a while yeah and it that feels like um Well, points. like finding an error in the programming code and using that I'll to do a it. speed run. Like, uh, yeah. You, you know, it's like you're, you know, if the intent is to play the game, then play the game. It's I don't like know. getting 100 points for chopping wood in the woods. Yeah. <laughs> and doing it for a, a yeah. year to get yeah. a high score. It's like, well, you got the high score, but you didn't really play the game. No, no. I mean, <laughs> and there's different ways of, of measuring. Ah, success. <laughs> yes. Yeah, there are, there are for sure. Look, the mines are crazy now. <laughs> crazy. Oh. oh, right back to zero. Right back to square one with crazy mines coming after you. Ah. Oh. Drexel, Drexel is is trying to argue the point that you're playing for points, and I do agree. I am, yeah. but in the rules, you can't do that. You can't just sit there and shoot something over and over again in this competition. Fair enough. So I think that was. I, think oh. I got a new high score for myself. Oh yeah, six eight twenty. For this round, six, I, eight, I did 20? I did better like w last, last time. time when you were playing I with think. Early? Yeah, I was just we we're just playing fast and loose. We we're just going crazy. And not well, doing too much strategy. Sometimes, uh... So I got 9,000 
Turn your ship at the edge so you're facing away from the center. So that's what he's talking about. So if you turn around, would they go the opposite direction? No, they're not. They're still going after your rear end there. <laughs> So I think the center of your ship has to be on. Yeah, yeah I'm, not, I'm not so good at this. Oh, I see what you're strategy. doing. The strategy. Ah, ha, ha. Run! Ah! Run! You can't stay still. I know, but I think I'm. I, 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 run, you know, I, run. I think I'm accelerating, but I'm not because I'm oh. actually hitting left and right. Do you know what I mean? Right. Yeah, you do have to hit it to turn around quickly. Yep. As soon as there's an opening, you cannot stop moving. There you go. Almost. That was close. It's relentless. <laughs> I suck at this. <laughs> oh, so funny. Go. Go See, I'm just, I'm just kind of going all over the place. <laughs> Like, the strategy is just, oh. has been destroyed. Run immediately. Uh, Quick, run. Ah, ha, ha. Ah. Lots of openings. Just have to get near them and shoot them. Easier said than done. <laughs> I know. It is not easy. He is a good opponent. There yeah. you go. There we go. Finally. Good job. <sighs> Mines go so fast on level two and forward, especially level three, that you can't even, you can't sit and just fire at it. You have to, you have to move all the time. <laughs> yeah, there is kind of an invisible wall where the outer ring is. So no matter if there is pieces there or not, it'll just bounce off. Hard to explain, easy when you see it done. So you're at the far right, firing right. Oh, oh. You're at the far right, firing right. Wrapping to far left, firing left. Okay, I see what you mean. I'm gonna try and, I'll try that in my turn. I'm not sure how that, good job. Very good job. Whew. I did warn her before the show that this ah. is an extremely hard game. Yeah, that's fair enough. Extremely challenging. You're just barely getting a second ring there. So your shot can go pretty far. Oh, not shot, completely. Shot the last one. <laughs> ah, run. Ah. Uh, just turn, can't turn. Run. You can't turn fast enough sometimes. No, you just gotta accelerate whatever direction you're going if they're that close. <sighs> Shots almost make it a completely oh, across the screen. Sometimes it's like you feel like you're. That was good. That was um, good. I think that that's your best score. Oh, thank you. Um, that's the one. <laughs> <laughs> well, you beat um, my lowest score now. <laughs> um. Okay, so let's see what I supposed to was talking about here. So you're at the right, but facing right, like this, so that they'll come for. Oh, I see, because they're gonna come for the right hand side. All I have to do is just move forward mm. a little bit, so that takes less time. Oh, no. It's not true. It's not coming. It's, it's not coming true. coming from the front. Oh, it disappeared. Or did you shoot it? Maybe I, I'm not far enough. Like that. Maybe it's like that. Uh, yeah, it's more like that. See, now he's coming. Oh, you know what? And you're shooting him and he hasn't turned towards you. Yes. That seems like a huge cheat. I don't think you can hit past the inner circle, though. Um, You'd have to... Hey, you can see. 
No, no, you're, you're oh, before. That's a problem. Your ship was completely not on the other side. See, he's turning now. So, ah, ah, ah. Yep. Woo! Good job. So See, that's there's definitely a tactic there. But you don't there. don't shoot the inner one yet but until you get everything. But don't don't let everything. a single pixel of you get past that uh, edge of the screen. That's yes, that's right. Yeah. That is that is kind of hard there to set are. up. So if you shoot here, I I I um, oh my gosh. Now he's turning. Which is fine, as long as I don't open it up, because you can get. Well, once you open it up, you just shoot over to the other side and, and you kill him. Blast, yep. Yeah. Just have to be careful. <gasps> See, I wasn't careful. Ah! <laughs> Mines are coming. To just get like that. Yeah, but you don't want to. I, I they do you follow mean. you, though. Those mines, it doesn't oh, help yeah, the mines. Oh, tracking you. So it's good. Um, Interesting. It's a good strategy for the end, maybe. Mm. Right before you get them. Mm -hmm. To get the final part of the inner circle. Yeah. So. Oh, I feel like your um, your booster at the back destroyed the mine. <laughs> Think it could. Oh, oh my oh. gosh! It came it wrapped around. I didn't even know it could do that. Yeah, it can. Oh. Oh, you're okay. Yeah, I'm gonna... Oh, you're getting, getting mine. Yeah! Okay, I think yeah, I understand. You're getting it. You're getting the, the that strategy. strategy. Yeah. It's kind of, kind of cheaty. Yes, that is gameplay technique. Yes. yes. Not cheating the game. No, because yeah. you're allowed to do this in the game. Well, yeah, you still... Oh, so uh, you just got killed by mine. So but you still attention. have to avoid mines. It's not like you're completely protected. No. It just offers an option to shoot from the other side without the, the internal ship heading towards you right away. Oh, oh the mines, the mines, they don't, it doesn't help with those guys at all. It only helps at the end. No! Get out of here. So really, all I have to worry about is the mines and not shooting the inner ring and getting rid of as much of the outer ring as possible. that noise is it's the tracking sound of the mines just think of it you're still increasing your score so yeah it's fine the problem is and it was this was explained bye, last Drexel. bye Drax this was explained last episode is that the mine the speed of the mines I think it was Thomas Jens, the yeah. programmer. He said the speed of the mines is directly related to your score, mm -hmm. not the level. So you could sit uh, at level one, and it gets harder and harder as you play. Uh, well, that's brilliant, actually, yeah. because so you can't game this. So thing. you can't, yeah, you can't just in artificially inflate your score by grinding away at mines. And... That's right. Ah. Okay, I'm just gonna go for it now. Uh, if I can, I can't because there's stupid mines and they go further. I think they just last a certain amount of time mm -hmm. rather than. So that's a good strategy. Good job. You're at Castle 4. Good job. But I think you've, you, you've beaten your old, old score. No. No? What I have was to get 10,000. 10,000. Pretty much to beat my Ooh, old score. Again, turquoise. I'm liking it. Look at them. Look at the fast they're moving. Ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Look! I can't even do anything because I'm see it's them. like I can see them. <laughs> it's like avoid the mines. I know, I it's know. It's a game of avoid well, the mines. Now. Maybe just stay in one spot and shoot mines for a while until until the opening opens up. 
Oh, they moved so fast. Uh, we were really close. I don't think I'm going to do much better. Lol, this is where all the button controller would, all button controller would be handy. Yeah. I don't, I don't know if it'll be easier with left, right, thrust, fire. Oh. Like all buttons. I'm not sure. Not sure it would. Oh, you opened the inner circle now. Now you're in ah, You made the fatal mistake. No, I didn't make the fatal mistake. <laughs> you have to turn around. You have to go through and start shooting. <laughs> Lord Monkus assures us that it's easier with all buttons. Okay. I will believe you, because I don't have one. I have a track and field controller. That would turn us left and right and fire. But I don't have... It doesn't have the extra button, the forward button. We need one more button. Um, I have the Asteroids Deluxe Cab, and it's much easier with just buttons to tr uh, than trying to play with on a controller. Hmm. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. You shot the last ring. Piece of the ring. It's coming. Watch out. Woof. Close. Ground Trooper. Hey, James and Tanya. Sorry I'm late. Distracted on YouTube and forgot. Lame, no. I know. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> so lame, Ground Trooper. I even read your name out at the beginning of the show. As a supporter. And were you one of the new? I think you were one of the new supporters. The new um, donators. You were and you missed your name. You're going to have to watch it in the repeats. <laughs> <laughs> on YouTube to catch your name. I sang your praises to everyone that was watching. Thank you for um, the Twitch Prime um, subscription. Thank you very much. Ah. And, and for those who are subscribing, it um, you have to renew every month, I think, like manually renew. I'm not sure how that works. Maybe it reminds you. Um, so the Starplex work. So will the Starplex work for the joystick layout? Well, if it emulates left, right, forward, and fire, then it should work. I'm not sure that it has any special considerations for other types of controllers. I'm sure it would just... I don't know. I don't have the Starplex, but... Oh, come on. Is that the one that I oh, supposed to say he had? Yes. So it does. It does work for the Starplex. Uh, Ground Trooper says, you are welcome. I will watch the props after the video is posted. <laughs> so that gets posted um, 24 hours later on YouTube. Or longer, depending on how, how quick I click the release release the video button. Oh, what happened? That was not very good. What happened? It's okay. Just trying things oh, out. Oh, still get on the board. <sighs> Barely. On the bottom. <laughs> on the bottom. Still sure means Starplex. Starplex is asteroid layout with left, right, down, up, fire. That actually works well. Left, right, and then mm. up on the right hand side, mm. and then fire. That'd be fine. It's a oh, shame you can't. Back for more torture. Left, right. Fire. Yeah. Uh, oh, because you have to you still thrust. have to have you one more. Thrust. It's not enough buttons. Yeah, and not quite. It can't access these buttons. Mm. It can only access two buttons on the Genesis controller. Which, which would be even fine. Um, you could make one um, thrust and one... I think it's time. Is it time? No, it's not enough shot out yet. Now it's time. Who barely nice. didn't get it. All you need to do is tap wrap edge to edge. Tap wrap. 
If you're firing away from the center, you're pointed the correct way to thrust. Yeah, 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 yeah. It doesn't help with mines though, so I don't... How do you deal with mines? They they continue to chase you off the screen and wherever you're going. But they do going. sometimes disappear. Like there was one that snuck up behind you. See, they disappear after they, a while. They do, but on the higher levels they don't. See, I'm too far. On the higher levels, they go so fast that... Careful, you're going to get all of the outer, outer rim. Yeah. Watch that outer rim. <laughs> See the... Annoying. Annoying. There's no time on it, so... accelerate while shooting, rather than turn around. Stop it! Oh, no! Run, it! Run! Run! Uh. Oh, no! Ah, uh, well. I can do it again now. There's no panic. He's, he's, he's protected from shooting. <laughs> <laughs> Go away, mines. Mm -hmm. No! It's good it takes two hits. Ah! Uh, uh, <laughs> whoa, I think I went right through a mine. Mm -hmm. the inner shell. Oh, I did! Oh. oh, I didn't even see that. Yeah, you broke the inner shell. <sighs> Woot! The final is linked into the high score thread. What? The final? Ah. Is the final ROM... No, no, from Ground Troopers. So. Oh, it always is. Yeah. It, the, the final ROM is always linked into the Homebrew Tournament thread on Atari Age, so you can grab it from there. I don't think he ever um, is going to put in a game that people can't just download as a ROM, because that's it's an unfair advantage to people who have to who purchase the game, right? Ah... Uh. East break 10,000. No! <laughs> there is a strategy to that I've found well. to not. Watch it. Oh! Ooh, actually, I should employ that strategy. Okay, well, what it is. Probably can't do it now. Oh, that. There's a strategy so that you can't destroy. Have you noticed that the mines themselves, if they're released, but then you go to the other side of the screen, they actually incorporate themselves back into the circle? See? Oh. But then they sometimes get released again. It, oh, but you... it's interesting, they get sucked back into the circle. Uh, sometimes they disappear. Sometimes, Sometimes they, go they back disappear, to the center. but but they will. If you cross the screen, they will stop following you and go back in the circle for at least a short period of time. Oh my god! Yeah. Uh, just too fast. do that haphazardly shoot things ah mm. so hard 70 70 no not t yeah <laughs> <laughs>
not her score. Oh. Uh, ROM out there. Yes, there is a ROM. Uh, I this. I this. Never, oh, you have it in complete in box, but never had the f time to play it. Um, yes, yes. Um, yeah, it's a beautiful box. And it also comes with a cardboard put together. Let me see. Let's get it out here. A little cardboard cutout thing that you can make your own little arcade stand up. Well, so you can make your own Star Castle arcade um, arcade machine. Uh, Little mini one. Doesn't come with screen or controllers. But it'll look nice on your shelf if you wish to um, destroy <laughs> what they sent you. Oh, comes with three, three pieces. There we go. Very, very nice, but I prefer to not mess with these things. Keep it nice, nice condition. I'll just what, look at pictures of other people putting it together. <laughs> the final is linked into the high score thread, Topic B. Topic B. It's two topics? Oh, you're going to get it. Oh, tricky. They do follow you. But yeah. I don't know at what point do they turn around. Oh, we opened it up. Oh, Bye. I didn't move fast enough on that Once one. Once it's opened up, he can get you from anywhere. His shots go fully across the screen. Oh, oh. right into the mine. This is not going well. <laughs> no. This is not going well this turn. Oh, it's so good. You went out the window. That was close. Oh. Can't sit still. <laughs> Can't sit still. No. Oh, the webcam is terrible. Pointing. Cats, cats. Yeah, I blame cats. Oh. There we go. Okay, that's better. That's a little better. It's at least straight, and it has the whole 2600 in there. Ah! Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> no, that was that was awful. No, you will accept the tea. <laughs> oh, you won't even get in there. Nope. <laughs> so that's. Oh my God, this game. This game is so hard. Shoot! 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 To, oh god. So now it's hard to make sure to not get the inner ring now. Oh, now I went and done did it. Oh, I got him, but I died. Oh well. Still have five ships. Could be worse. Mine's waiting on the other side for me. Terrible. I think that works very well. Somebody with more skill than me works well. See, I, I noticed if you do this, well, you lose because you shoot, shoot every piece. But you don't accidentally hit the inner ring if you're kind of at an angle. There's no chance of hitting Ooh. the inner ring. How do you manage that? Strategy to sit in one place and just shoot the mines? I don't know. Or is that take too much time on? Or is it too dangerous? Okay, let's do it. Ah! Ah! Damn it. That's 
the risk you run when you just do go for a... Complexity in this game in the sprites because if you look there is no turn sprite function in an Atari 2600 every single one of these is a separate sprite mm. and same with the guy in the middle too when you say the mines the mines are separate sprites what? no I mean each the, the um, star castle in the middle okay oh I'm sorry. each tiny turn I don't, I don't know if there's 16 of them I'm guessing there's 16 or mm. maybe more actually um, each of them is an individually stored graphic really yeah. because of the Be color not because of the color because of the angles that it has to rotate oh, there's no rotate function gotcha. on the 2600 gotcha 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 so you have to draw everything oh my goodness so there's oh. the graphic for every position of the York ship and for the Star Castle too. Atari is back. Atari to watch us play Atari. Yeah, he was never the bad cat. <laughs> he was never the bad cat. He's just <laughs> has to be kicked out at the same time. He's a fluffy cat. He is shedding something crazy right oh, now. Oh, I didn't think I'd get him. Did I die too? I uh, think I did. Yes. Yes. My goodness. My score was a six. Six I, something. I think I have to defeat this guy. I too. think you do to really get up there. This, yeah. this, I mean, the mines go like nuts in this level. Yeah, that's the problem I have with this level. Is the mines. I'm sure that strategy. See, they do turn around. They don't completely follow you. So, see, then they. They do incorporate themselves back in, but they get shot back out. Which is interesting. An interesting little detail. Yeah. Uh -oh. oh. Did I open it up? I did. Nuts. Oh! It's not how I wanted to die if I was going to die. I wanted to be <laughs> shot by that ship. It's not how I wanted to die. Damn it! Oh. 75. I'll take another turn because I have an Atari in my lap right now. So. <sighs> and he's purring something wonderful. He loves love. He loves love. Yes, he loves he to give love. Aww. He's one of the best cats in the world. <laughs> Can't say the best because I haven't met them all. No, that's true. But he's right up there. You're uh, one of them. Yes, you are. Unfortunately, he's covered up by the Atari on the no. That's okay. He is. Oh, you can see him. He's a, a travesty. I know. Oh. Oh, oh, oh! Whoa. Oh, that was so close. I wasn't even looking at mine. <laughs> it's the first level that just so sluggish. In comparison, yeah. Oh. Get out of here, pesky. You know what movie they're playing tonight? It was a Disney movie, they said. Oh. I, but it was Disney movie, blah, blah. And I couldn't hear it. They played Peter Rabbit last time. Yes. Okay. You don't need to go anywhere, but tap wrap to left and tap wrap to right. <laughs> tap left? Really? What? Is it like a specific spot? I don't think I'm quite understanding. Is he saying like tap do this? But tap. you don't need to go anywhere, but tap wrap to left and tap wrap to right. Always fire away from center. Wrap Damn before it. mines come close. Wrap. Yeah, I kind of I understand the, exactly the wrapping Exactly horizontal part. from castle. Right. No, no, he doesn't need a cat right now. There you go. Oh. Terry 
always here for moral support. Oh, watch out! No. Oh. You have to be fully on the other screen for them to, yeah, for them to stop chasing you. Not just a little bit. No, the see, that's not even true. That guy came right through. Mm-hmm. They do disappear after a while. They do. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. terrible. All for nothing. <laughs> now he's fully protected again. Oh. Oh. Die, 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 die. <laughs> that doesn't work. That does not work. He just rebuilds. They can rebuild their space station so quickly. I know. That Death Star goes up real fast, doesn't it? Yep. Ready for the next movie. Yeah. <laughs> No one seems to age. It's like, like yeah. you know, Fast six workers. months go by. <laughs> That's too dangerous to be that close. Oh, oh I'm covered in cat blood. Yeah, that's the danger. How did that happen? That How? How did that happen? the end of the movie. They're yelling about something. No, it, no, I think it's just starting. No, no, no. It has to get dark. Oh! It, they, they, they were playing music for a while, and they went, when, before I came down, they said, oh. sorry, before I came down, they said, the movie will be, will, will be showing the movie in two hours time, because it oh. has to get dark. Oh, okay. Yeah. Almost got it. You aren't horizontal from Star Castle. You always shoot. So, so your you shots wrap. Always, yes. Okay. You don't need to go anywhere. <laughs> How can you not go anywhere? I, I feel I is I is supposed to. You need to um, post a, a YouTube tutorial on. <laughs> like you're either on the left or the right. And he says face the opposite direction, mm. but you have to be exactly horizontal with the star castle. That's almost pretty subtle. That? You don't need to you just need tap left and right? Oh flip around. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Okay, here's a mine. Still chasing me. I don't believe you. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand what you're trying to... See, how can you tap left and right? You can turn left or right, you can't tap it. Tap to wrap to the left, yeah, turn 180. Tap shift to right, okay, then turn 180. Oh, well, yeah, that's what I was doing. You mean tap accelerate? that and then turn 180 and then shoot 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 because yeah. you can sh it, your shots will wrap around yeah and you can get to the sent second one which is up uh, which is all that you need is to get to the second one because af after you destroyed it down to one segment what just wasn't looking for mines I guess No. no! Oh. See, I'm not even looking for mines. <laughs> Dinner is calling. You read the rest? 
Yeah, Ground Trooper just says, dinner is calling. If I don't make it back, have fun and good luck. We're going to need to play this one more. As I have stated before, totally amazing. The whole package, top notch, and an amazing feat for the 2600. Agreed. This is a really fun game. Challenging. A really it's fun so game. So hard. Yeah, it's a really fun game, though. Where's the edge of the screen? Are you still on the first level? Yes. <laughs> I'm trying techniques out, that's what I... No, I understand. Yeah. Yeah, I, I do. I have a little, little Oops. fluffy. Come here, come here. Come here. Oh, oh, I love you, cat. But I'm not paying attention. Because I'm... So trying to get the firing technique. The mines get me. But I kind of understand where <laughs> what he's getting at. Yeah. Kind of. Like shooting from one side. Yeah, okay. And then when the mines get close, you tap to get over and you turn around. Okay. Is this is this what you meant? Like that's it? I guess I get it. <laughs> I just have to watch for the mines. Oh, you, you have... But if I don't tap fast enough, they will chase me. Yeah. And follow me. Well, also, you've hit the inner circle, so oh. it could be that they get more aggressive. Oh, it could be. This cat is asleep in my arms right oh, now. Oh, adorable. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> He's so sweet. He's a little heavy, though. Oh, yeah. A bit of a chunky monkey. <laughs> Not too bad, but... <laughs> Uh. <laughs> oh, sweetheart. Oh, he's, he's awake now. No, no, he was. Was he? He was snoring in my ear. Well, he's a he's a cutie. He's a heavy breather. <laughs> no, he was. His eyes were closed. Yeah. And then my earring flipped against his ear, and he didn't like that Damn too it. Again, if you want. I suppose says yes, don't let mines get close or mines will wrap too. Just stay in the left. Oh, so H move, move very... before they get close enough and then okay. they won't wrap with you. So don't you want... wait for the last second. Okay. Oh. Oh, no, you can go. Oh, this no is... panic yet. This is still first level. Okay, so you have to wrap when they get kind of close. Next button. Oh. <laughs> So I think I think I understand oh, and now it's just getting the technique down. That's too much of a an acceleration, it's just a tap. Uh, uh. Enough to get you across fully across the screen. No, you're too far. Actually you're not, you're fine. Waiting too long. Now you're gonna die. Ah, you can't do that. I don't know how. <laughs> um, this is really hard. You can't be on that side of the screen already <laughs> firing at him. You have to be on the other side firing. Oh my at him. goodness, this is awful. <laughs> there. Oh, 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 I was shooting. You were. What was going on there? Oh, you're shooting right through. Get him. Almost. Oh my that goodness, so what is close. going on? Just missed him. Okay. Oh, you're totally messing up. <sighs> This is terrible. <laughs> it was the aiming. It was just the aiming. I know. Get it, get it, get it. Oh. Get him. All right. Oh, I don't know how that worked. <laughs> it, it was like wrapping around the <laughs> that screen. That was uh, shockingly. <laughs> I guess it's. Oh, man. Boom. <laughs> I like hitting it. Oh, come on. Yeah, there you go. Oh. oh now I can hear the movie. Come on, it's coming. Oh. 
just wasn't fast enough there. Yeah. Kind of understanding how you have to point the other way though. Uh, I know. And then, oh, there you go. Oh, it was too late. <laughs> that mine like used your gravity to thrust, ah! thrust itself around. I know, somehow. that was actually pretty funny. Yeah. Like totally missed you and mm -hmm. warped itself around. And I also must say the, the music's really good too. Mm -hmm. Excellent, excellent music. Who did the music? Oh, Richard Kulor Arm Armijo. Not I supposed to. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Drop the ball. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh, it's the same thing. It doesn't really matter. Oh, at this he point. he is seeing me on this side. That yeah. Is, that is a problem. Nope, he flipped over. That's there you go. What you there. Want. You want him looking at your ass. <laughs> because, oh, the one's coming close. There we go. Oh, no, oh, don't shoot He's the center. He's coming close. Yes, see, I neglect the mines when I'm doing this. It looks keep easy to. About them. I feel we were doing better before we were trying to actually, like, enact this technique of. Like, sometimes well, the random shit works better. It's it's like hunting and pecking on the keyboard. You can get good at it. Yeah. But when you start doing it properly, um, you have to start from scratch again. And you're slow again. Yeah, Because you're doing true. the proper technique. You're learning, you're learning the technique as you go. But as you speed up on the proper technique... Be careful. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to watch the mines again. No! <gasps> oh, I saw that coming. <laughs> yeah, so did I. Yeah, it's just a tap. Just a tiny tap to get it on the opposite side of the screen. <gasps> Careful. Oh, see, I'm not looking. You only have one tiny little shot left of the pink layer. Yeah, don't want to get that. Yeah. But it takes so... The problem so there's another mine on this. Mine, too on, close. It's mine too close. on both sides. Yeah. At that point I think I should have just gone out of there. I mean realistically the first couple of layers it doesn't matter. You don't have to be lined up. Yeah, that's true. You know, it's just the last layer, your approach to the last layer that you have to like you can move around the board and just kill those layers. Uh, Thought it was open enough, but it was not. That was stupid. Oh, that <laughs> and now he's fully protected again. Looking, erg. Too concentrated on not hitting the wrong shell parts. To bother looking for the mines. Like, are you saying not, not do this technique till the end? But then it's not even a technique. Then <laughs> it's just like the last piece to before you go after the dude. Which is fine. Oh, I slipped. <laughs> Damn it! Terrible, terrible score. Ugh, mine's gonna be worse. <laughs> I'm not even gonna. 
You can back and forth just a thrust tap, even when the castle's firing at your ship. What? That sounds dangerous. You can go back and forth doing that? Yeah, I guess you could if you got the timing right. Because he has to turn around. He takes a long time to turn around. Not a long time, but enough time to turn around. If you're horizontal from the castle, the mines have a better chance of sticking back onto the rings. Oh, that's why. Interesting. Oh, I see, because the chances of them turning around and running into the Star Castle area is much... Ah! Oh, I didn't... I didn't even know I'd, I'd <laughs> broken a hole in. Yeah, that's the dangerous part. He still has a hole broken move. <laughs> Yep. Fly, little ship, fly! Oh, almost. Ooh, that was close. Now, oh, he was smacked into it before he shot. There was no friction. Because you just speed up along the bottom and then turn and go fire, 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 fire. You'd always get them. Oh, don't shoot that last. How is this possible? How is what possible? There is no ring part left on one of the rings. Oh, you're right. Yet it didn't regenerate a ring. Can I play again? Yes. <laughs> I'm just, I'm fooling around that now. That was very weird. That was very weird. I was like, there's hardly any pieces left. How is this possible? Huh. It was, it was, that uh, was a glitch. Definitely. Hmm. Oh, some miscalculation going on there. Uh, recall all the cartridges. <laughs> Gotta fix them. Oh, come on. Yeah, back to the drawing board, Thomas Yentz. I saw an error. That was interesting. Maybe because it was a ring that was in the middle? No, that always that always results in expansion. So we'd see that way more often if that was the case. It didn't regenerate because oh good job. Because one half of one outer ring was still there. Really? But a, but a, I didn't even notice that. There was there was Oh, the outer ring. Oh, so you can, can you as long as there's some of the outer ring, you can destroy all the inner ring. Really? That's what he's I implying. Did, yeah, that's what he is implying. I didn't know that. No, I didn't know that either. That's very, very well, good to know. That's very helpful information because that was not the impression I got. Let me read that part in the instructions again. Oh, it is. Beware that completely eliminating the outer oh, ring will cause the remaining energy rings to expand outward. Okay. That makes things very different. The middle was gone. The center was almost gone. The outer ring was still there. So you could completely eliminate every single piece of the ring except for one outer piece. Not very good at this game. <laughs> Oh, this is my uh, worst score submission so far. Relative score submission for any. <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> Turn around. Oh, that makes me laugh. So don't shoot that last piece. And you did. Oh, I didn't mean to. <laughs> and then I got hit by a mine. Well, that. Oh, okay. Because I was trying not to destroy the inner oh, rings. Oh, shoot. This is just not going well. 
So that, okay, well, that's, that's something different. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> because I was being very strategic and not, not right shooting things. That was not very good. Think not a, a terrible score. I think you get a score. I think you get on the board. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Exclamation mark. I do like an exclamation mark. There you go. Is that your 70, best? Sem no, 70, 70, no, 5860. 5860 is yeah. your best, yeah. yeah. That top one is mine. It's yours, yeah. You accidentally put mine in, so. Okay, let's try this again. Now that I know I don't have to be careful of the middle ring. Blast away at anything I want. As long as you keep a part of the middle ring. Or the outer ring. Outer ring. So not that piece. Oh. And I did it. <laughs> but accidentally. <laughs> but you just have to be careful not to shoot the inner ring. Either. And watch for mines. <laughs> They are your enemy. Not that it's super. <laughs> oh. I'm right up the ass. <laughs> yep. Okay, let's do it. Oh. Oh, you created a hole! Oh, good job! Good job! As long as it's still open, Oof. you can just do that. Yeah. As long as it's not facing you, and it's very destroyed shield, it's not too bad. You just go in the opposite direction. Oh! Uh. And watch for mines. <laughs> That's my biggest issue right now, is not watching for mines. Mine's coming, mine's coming. Thank you. Constantly and coming. And another mine coming. <laughs> constantly coming. I don't even get a chance. It's terrible. You don't have to be there to shoot the rings. It's just the inner oh. ring. Yeah. You can move around. It doesn't That's seem true. to make that much of a difference. No. Just as long as you don't hit the inner ring until you're lined up. Yes. Good enough to destroy a castle. Nice. Okay. Once you master the get horizontal, wrap, rotate 180, it, it gets too hard then. You basically have to thrust below the rings, stop thrust, spin 45 degrees, fire the castle, spin yeah. back 45 to thrust. Well, I can see that's why the button controls are better because using the joystick, you don't have such precise movement left and right. Yeah. Whereas with the button, it's, it's like it's left, 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 already. right, right, right. It's it's incremental, right? Yeah. Yeah. And if you shoot a piece of the ring that the mine is on, mm. it will release. They release anyway, but but if you happen to shoot one. shoddy effect if you accidentally touch one of the pieces of it. Get out of here! Oh, both killed. Eh, There's castle okay. four. Ships four. Oof, Very good. I am not doing terrible. And we're at level turquoise. So. <laughs> level turquoise. Yes. The beautiful level of turquoise. Oh, I love turquoise. Actually, uh, I'm very impressed with the color of the ship too. That it's is, nice, is soft uh, blue. corn flower blue kind <laughs> of color. So. Yes. Yes. It's not the corn flower blue. 
Is that in American Psycho? They describe something as corn. Oh, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> it's either in American Psycho or it was in Office Space. Cornflower blue. Yes, it was a it was a color of a tie. I don't know why. And you don't hear that that color description all that often anymore. Cornflower oh, blue. Oh no, I think it was in Fight Club. I don't know. Ah, oh. Okay, I have to beat this, or I will not get anywhere near. Too fast, you can't do that technique on this level. Or at this. Uh, oh! Terrible! You're so close, you still haven't beat. I think Erlen pushes you. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> my turn? Yeah. Okay. Oh, this okay. might be my last turn. Yep. I'm getting my a little next... frustrated with it, so. It's a frustrating game. My next one's my last one, too. Next button over. That might be why I'm not doing so well. Yeah, you're not firing at all. <laughs> Mine's coming. Oh, that was uh, a risky move. Trying I don't to fire know through. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Let's just be let's just be frank. Yeah. I'm just kind of all over the place here. Be that scientist dog that meme on the internet. There's a, a, a dog in a lab coat. Oh, yeah. And the dog says, I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's an old meme. Yes. An oldie but a goodie, right? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> my, Turn. My yeah. random... Uh, <laughs> my random... Oh, right into it. <laughs> right into it. You anticipated. Do it, do it. Yeah! <laughs> oh, man. Four ships, not bad. Yeah, yep, still in the game. That's how I was playing last time. Ah! I was just <laughs> ran right into it. I know. I <laughs> I just don't. I know, but Turn. it's I just I'm not used to that um, mechanic. No, it's an old <gasps> old oh, mechanic. No. Oh, no. Old way of moving around. Oh, there we go. That's no. Sometimes that's better. Yeah, because it stops him from... Yeah, if you've accidentally opened up one thing, that's actually a good strategy to get it to close back up again. Especially when you have no chance of getting it. Pretty good. I think you yeah. could take him. If you do time it right, you're not horizontal with him. You're gonna do shoot... I have to be horizontal with him? Because you'll shoot right through him if you're not on track with him. Okay. Yeah, see, that's turn around, 180, and then dive forward. Ah! No, don't thrust. There, now go. Ah! Oh, go. See, you're not helping me. <laughs> <laughs> Just confusing you. Yeah. Left, right, straight, stop, fire. <laughs> no, left. Is that straight? Go quick, mine's coming. There you oh, go. I get it. Okay. Hey, this might be your best game. Yeah, it might be. Or might it's a good one to end up on. <laughs> Oh. oh my gosh, I don't know how I survived that. Barely. Just barely. Run. Stupid mines. Yes. They become terrible. Ah! Oh. oh my gosh, he released that too fast. Okay. <sighs> Bit of, a lot of coverage there going on. I'm going to take out some more. Before. Oh, I, how did I do that? I didn't even see a hole. Run, <laughs> run. Now it's time to kill him if you can. Oh, man. So close. 5870 is not terrible. Wait, don't press. Wait, wait, I've done wait. better. I've done worse. Is that your best? No. No? I don't think so. Is that... 5870. Yeah, I, by best. 10 points. <laughs> you retired on your best. Uh, I'm good, good with that. I'm good with that. 5870 is not terrible. We'll enter that into uh Yeah. Considering you wouldn't tell me what game we were playing so I couldn't practice beforehand. I don't practice. That's totally not fair. I don't practice. Yeah, but you got to play with Erlen. Oh, I guess. <laughs> yeah. It's entirely not fair. Yeah. 
That could give you a USB controller and you could play it on Stella on your lap each sure. upstairs. Yeah, but that wouldn't be the same as, as the joystick. No. So. Did you and Erilyn play it with the joystick controller? No, we didn't. This was uh, so Or did unfair. we? I think we did, actually. Yeah, this was working then. I think you'd have more control with the, the regular Genesis controller. No, no, you slip. Oh, really? Yeah, because it's meant for, like, free, con like, moving around. Like, I don't think it's good for precision, like, left-right type of games like this. Uh oh, you got a hole. Oh! I just gotta get him. Oh, not like that. <laughs> Need to get on his level. Oh! Invisible wall. Okay, turn around. Get him! Yay! It was close, a mine was that close. Good job, good job. Six lives? Good. Good start. Yeah. Good start how every game of this should start, actually, is getting six lives. The graphics are really detailed in this game, if you notice. Like, you shoot one of the... Damn it. I'm not watching. If you Grand shoot... Trooper! Welcome back. I hope back. you enjoyed your dinner. <laughs> Welcome back from dinner. <laughs> Get out of here. Ah, what am I doing? Not even lined up. Oh, oh right into it. Oh, this is going to be a terrible game uh, now. <laughs> no. Your cornflower flower blue ship will prevail. <laughs> prevail and building a ship is, is shield right back up again. Oh, the mines. <laughs> the mines. No! Oh no, well. The mines. It's coming for you! Oh! oh thank you. A little late, a little late, yeah. I'm sorry. It's okay. Did I shoot that last piece? Damn it. Careful! score only halfway there terrible but yes good job when you defeat him strategically on purpose that is a well played game when you defeat him while flailing around eh. no oh careful too I'm trying to be Ah, get out of here. Oh. Damn it. Oh, you know why Ground Trooper can do that? Put those things? Because mm -hmm. he donated money. <laughs> I was like, how can he do that? And nobody else can. Do they know not know how to do it? But nope. That's cool. Not donated money, but he subscribed. By subscribing, you get to, you get all the extra, I don't get know what you call Get to annoy everyone else. Images, emojis. Uh, what do they call them? I'm sure they they have a name. <laughs> not emojis. Stickers. Stickers. Maybe stickers. Yes. It's kind of a lame yeah. name for them though. <laughs> it's like it's like you're in grade school. You get stickers for doing well. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, see, emotes. Thank you. It's emotes. Our spot. Everyone's got access. Everyone. Oh, okay. Ah. It's just that ground trooper has found them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, terrible. I'm I'm done. I'm done. Terrible. About you. I didn't beat my old score. I'm not good at this game. I don't think you did terrible. Uh, terribly. I mean, you came close, but well, it is an extremely high challenging score. game. 
And I, yeah, I think, I, I agree, I think um, there may be better controllers for this game. Well, they're saying button control. Yeah, yeah. Is better control. Like, I don't, the joystick in the left and right, I can see, I can see having the control of the, of the buttons uh, helping quite a bit, so. Cool. Yeah, <laughs> maybe. I mean... Gave up all my tips. Oh, that's okay. I mean, they do work up to a point, but then the minds just start going nuts at you. Yeah. And then you can't have time. And then, like you said, he has it's very you have, precise. You have, you have to, to do be the very 45, precise. 45 yeah. thrust, 45 mm -hmm. thrust, 45 thrust. And I can see the oh, buttons no. working really well there. Yeah. You go left, left thrust, like. One, two, like two thrust, taps. Sh -sh -sh -sh. Yeah. Yeah. One tap, one tap, one tap, thrust, yeah. fire, fire, yeah. fire. And doing the pattern. Well, that's what I mean, because you, you have more control over the left and the right with the button. Yes. And that I could see being really helpful in this game. So. Yeah, that's true. But I'm also kind of spazzy. <laughs> uh, it, 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 uh, I, I almost prefer the random well. approach. <laughs> yeah, it's f flailing and firing uh, at everything. Atari Spot. I stink at this game with pretty much all joysticks, but somehow I'm pretty good playing with the keyboard. Yeah, and I think it's you have more control with the buttons. So. Yeah, I wonder if playing with the keyboard. I haven't played too long on the computer. I could see. This game. I could see. Like again, because it's it's the button press. You know, yeah, the precision button pressing yeah. of it all. Um, so we have a lot of stuff coming up, actually, mm -hmm. in terms of shows, which is nice because for a little while there I had nothing planned. Mm. It goes in waves like that. It's like tons and then nothing. Yeah. <laughs> and then I panic because there's nothing planned and maybe I overdo it and stuff. Um, obviously there's the two uh, exclusive games that are coming up. One is the Dan Kitchen duo games of uh, Keystone Capers 2, which has not been renamed yet, hasn't been given a name. And the other one, which now I've forgotten the name of. Oh, damn it. It's the uh, Titanic game <laughs> that I uh, was talking about, where you have to steer the Titanic. We okay. have no details on that game mm -hmm. yet, whether you're going to crash the Titanic on purpose or whether you're steering the Titanic mm -hmm. to safety. Probably steering to safety. I don't know. I'm, I I can come up with all kinds of scenarios for that one. So yes. Yeah. And then we driving have, it into it towards the the but then, glacier. But then the, the the icebergs have to move somehow out of your way. Well, That's weird. Like, but even yeah. trying to avoid them. They but can, I mean, if the game is hard enough and has infinite levels, then yeah. you will always hit the glacier. So That's I can right. kind of see that you're trying to avoid it. So. Or you're trying to get people yeah. onto the lifeboats. You're trying to collect them, and they're running around like crazy, and you go. Or Boop, maybe you bring them over to the you're lifeboats. You're just you're playing the strings as the ship goes down. That's right. You're you're just playing the violin <laughs> as you watch people jump into the water, and <laughs> you're trying to stay on your seat yeah. and play while you try and stay on your yeah. seat. You're <laughs> rocking left to right yeah. on on the deck of the ship. Yeah. Um, <laughs> then there's the other exclusive one that I can't tell you about is coming up. That one's probably before the Dan Kitchen one. Okay. That one's coming up in a couple of weeks and probably nice. by next show, I'll be able to reveal what it is and who mm -hmm. it's by and all the rest of it, mm -hmm. which will be great. Cause he says that'll be very, very soon. The details revealing it. Um, the next episode is Blinkies goes up unless something else drastically changes. We're okay, going to do cool. a 100% completion. Erlen's going to be here next Wednesday for okay. that. Can I play too? Uh, yeah. Do we have you, enough space for three in? people? Oh, this couch is big enough for okay. three. Yeah. I'm going to have to practice. Because it's a short, it's a fairly short game. Yeah. Like, I mean, until you die. Like, it's not a long, it's like 20 minute game um, till, till, till death. Mm. Just needs more sounds. Hey! Hush. <laughs> Hush, how are you supposed to? <laughs> no talking about things like that. Um, and then we've got a whole bunch of work in progress episode next Friday with Drexel. Dar okay. Darcy, I believe if he's here, I think next week is his. It's his week to be here if week, he's yeah. around. Yeah. And then uh, Ladybug is the okay. next month. Okay. That one's hard. But I can get better at it. Okay. <laughs> it's not like this. It's a maze game, Ladybug. 
Yes, yeah, I know the game. Yeah, yeah so it's, that it's, it's sort of Pac-Man like. Pac-Man-ish. Like, it's a maze. Like, you have to yeah. eat things. You yeah. change things. But you go the... through the walls and they, they flip. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah but yeah. there's like multipliers. So those will come into factor. Okay. You have to eat things in certain order to get mm. the most points. Okay. Um, but I think I'll be way better at that. Compared relatively to than to Star Castle. Yeah. Um, then we've got a bunch of other stuff. Anything else interesting? Um, we're going to play do some... Halloween games. I yes. need I need some Halloween people to themes. suggest yeah. some Halloween games. Uh, I don't know if there's enough original homebrew Halloween games. I think if might they have to delve are into the hacks. Original, yeah, homebrew, yes, okay. Because yeah, I don't think a lot of people have made original homebrew yeah. Halloween games. I think there's more on the Christmas oh, side of the house. So many um, holiday games, yes, yeah. and we'll we'll be doing that around uh, uh, Christmas as well, Christmas December, stuff. yeah. And there's enough to probably fill all of December, <laughs> or mm. at least, you know, Fridays in December, or something like that. It's mm. going to be a lot. It's just cat hair flying everywhere. Um, we've got some specials that haven't been placed. We're going to do a trackball special. Games that have been adapted mm. to the trackball. Nice. Do we have a trackball? Yes, we do. Oh! Yeah, so it's going to be lots of fun, <laughs> trackball-y, roll-y games. So you're going to hear zzz, 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 zzz. <laughs> A lot. All right. That's going to be over two days. We're going to have a Pac-Man day of all the different Pac-Mans. So bad at Pac-Man. <laughs> okay. We're going to briefly play the original just to show it off. Mm. And then there's a hack, Pac-Man 8K by Nuki Shea. And then there's Pac-Man 4K by Dennis Debro. Then there's Pac-Man 4K by Dintari816. And then a Pac-Man 8K by Dentari 816. Mm. So there's one, two, three, four, five. F five total that will be showing off. Oh, so okay. that'll Lots be interesting. Games. Contrast and compare. And okay. I'll have to dig up how the original Pac-Man works. Like how ghosts move, how you move. Because some of these are going for realism. Okay. Trying to make it like they are the arcade mm -hmm. and the ghosts are moving like the arcade so you can because in the arcade version you can do a pattern that gets all the ghosts on top of each other so that when you get the power pellet you go do 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 all eat all four mm -hmm. and that's how those people got perfect scores oh in pac-man they ate every ghost with every power pellet on every level i was like oh, how gosh. did they ever do that but i but read there's probably a route to follow to yeah, get them to follow you and to because they each yes. have a different pattern they do one follows you directly yeah. one kind of goes in the area but doesn't get close to you mm. he'll never chase you right to you mm. he'll just kind of block you and mm. make life miserable one kind of goes somewhere else but and some something like that yeah yeah, yeah but yeah. they all have a pattern in, in their movement yeah they all have a very distinct pattern mm. so some of these i believe the dentari 816 are, are going for arcade perfect movement in the ghosts mm -hmm. and there's also a miss pac-man d make into regular pac-man mm. because miss pac-man was much better on the 2600 yes like yeah. the graphics the maze layout mm. so it's much easier to hack that to be pac-man to, to again. be pac-man again yes i mean what i think of a, of, of as pac-man is actually miss pac-man that's right. what i played like i don't remember people, playing the original pac-man i yeah. remember miss pac-man i think most that a lot people more. played yeah, Ms. they think Pac of Pac-Man, but they actually mean Miss Pac-Man. Yes, yeah. I think so too. Yeah. Um, what else? What other games? Oh, we're going to have a puzzle day. Ooh, All like puzzle. puzzle so that's one's going to be for you. I'll yeah, schedule I like it for the you. Puzzle games. <laughs> which includes 2048 and 3S and a bunch of other ones. And uh, yeah, some... And an early prototype episode where it's a bunch of games that just kind of barely got started. Okay. But they're playable and they're really exciting if they ever got finished. Mm. Some of them are like a decade old and never never, got never made it. Mm. Crazy Valet, Puzzle. Can you... And anybody who has suggestions for any of these. Yeah. Um, even I want to do another hack show. So if you have some good hacks that are worthy... Not just graphic hacks, they have to be like um, 
play of like the way it's played has to change or the the screen layout has, it has to, to change. It has to be substantial. It has to be substantial, not just yeah. changing Miss Pac Man into Pac Man. Yeah. It yeah. has to change something. Yeah. The if if you're changing Miss yeah. Pac Man into Pac Man, but there's a change to the like, layout or something. Or the way it plays different. or yeah. something. Yeah. Yeah, so please message me in the Atari Age forums or you can whisper. Don't try not to do it here in the main chat because I'll have to scroll back and it's difficult. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, I suppose if you could message me. Um, so I'm looking for hacks, good hacks. I'm looking for puzzle games. Um, what else am I looking for? Any homebrew that you think's awesome that I have not done on the show yet? Mm. Um, there's tons out there, even old stuff. That's really good too. Hmm. Um, I don't care if it's brand new or really old. Um, yeah, and early prototypes that never got finished. I'm looking for those too. Um, that's about it, I think. Yep, for stuff I'm looking for and upcoming things. Mm -hmm. And also, make sure you subscribe to, well, follow Twitch, or if you want to subscribe, if you have um, Twitch Prime. Um, Amazon Prime. Just click that subscribe button. Mm -hmm. Cost you nothing. Supports the channel. Um, subscribe to YouTube. I'm like two people away from a hundred subscribers. Yeah. <laughs> it's been it's crazy. slowly it's creeping like, up, just, and I'm like, come on, come on, just click subscribe. <laughs> I know it's terrible to tell people to click subscribe, and yeah. you hear it everywhere. But yeah, yeah if you want to keep up to date on everything that's going on with the show, also social media, Facebook, mm -hmm. Twitch, um, Instagram. I post pictures of stuff sometimes. <laughs> I try to. I'm very, very busy. Um, and, oh, and I'm also a filmmaker, if you didn't know that. Mm. And I just got into two more festivals with my feature film. So I'm very excited about that. Yeah. Um, they haven't been announced yet anywhere, so I can't tell you where they're yeah. playing yet. And I'm not sure this crowd would be as interested you in the be content interested. of the film. But... It has nothing to do with video <laughs> games. Although I would love possibly to make a film... A documentary film about homebrew in the future at yeah. some point but not right now because i just finished a feature documentary and it film. took you four years it took to four do years it. to do it and that was exhausting so i want to do some fictional film right now but none of you care because you're here <laughs> for the video games yeah don't you don't care about my other things that i do in my life unless they're video game no related. that's not true but it's yes. it's at the same time it's it's um not not I mean, it's fashion related. So, yeah, it's, yeah, it's not quite. It's a social same. issue, yeah. fashion stuff. Yeah. Um, if you can find it, good on you. Yeah. <laughs> See if you can find out the name of it. Yeah. Without me telling you. Yeah. Actually, it's not that hard. You know my real name. Yeah. <laughs> um, and Portland. We're going to Portland. I'm so excited. I love Portland. Less I love than going. two months. I can't believe it's coming up so fast. Yeah. So yeah. seven weeks. It's coming. I think it's on the twentieth or something like that. Yeah. Um, so if you're going to Portland. Come, yeah. Say hi if you say, see me wandering around. I don't have a booth or anything. I'm not selling yeah. anything. Yeah. I'm just a dude there. Yeah. Um, but but we'll I will be, be doing some interviews with uh, people there that are involved in homebrew. Mm -hmm. um, can't remember the names right now, but <laughs> <laughs> I'll be doing some interviews with uh, anybody. Anybody that does old school homebrew stuff. Um, so they haven't posted who's appearing there yet like the booths and I stuff i think a lot of the time that gets posted about a month before yeah. So, yeah so i'll have to arrange it last minute but it doesn't take much they just say yes and then i yeah go and talk to them for a couple minutes and mm -hmm. go, okay. what do you think about homebrew but better questions yeah <laughs> do you do homebrew um thank you i suppose to i always uh wonder if it's a good stream because <laughs> i don't watch them afterwards because i live them but i'm glad you enjoyed it um and we'll be back wednesday mm -hmm. and i think we're going to go for the 11 o'clock 11 a.m next wednesday with erlen oh okay. worked out then really well i won't i won't be around then for that oh yeah that's fine that's all right for blinky goes i out. have this this, this we'll see. horrible thing called a job that basically Ew. runs uh, uh, you know gross <laughs> nine to five so, yeah yeah um what i'll can see I what do? i'll see what erlen wants to do because you want to play blinky goes you played it I did. No, I, I was going to say, if you're playing it, I'll, pl I'll play some more and, and try to do a little better. The poor Europeans but that's okay. never get to see the show. No, no, it's okay. No, you don't have to wait for Last me. Last time all yeah, the Europeans were like, oh, think... we finally get to see yeah. it. <laughs> no, no, play, do it, do it at 1130. It's just 11. a shame. 11. 11. 11. Yeah. Okay. Or whenever. We don't know yet. We, 
Yeah. Uh, so we'll see. No, no, no. I, I totally understand. Yeah. Like it's I just said, giving options. Nine to five jobs kind of suck, but what can you do? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so that is it for now. Um, yeah. Until next, uh, until Wednesday and then uh, Friday again. Um, and uh, until that time, thank you for tuning in mm -hmm. to Zero Page Homebrew. And there's our name, so I don't have to ever say our names anymore, <laughs> which is nice. One last thing. Um, so, yeah, thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you. Oh, Atari wants to say bye. Not really, but. No, he doesn't make actually want to say bye. Hi. He says goodbye. Bye bye. Can you hear him purr? He's purring. If you lift him up to the microphone. Now we stop. Because <laughs> he's like, what is this? Is he purring? No. No. Of course. He doesn't not. want it. He, he doesn't want to be He purred, but he didn't like being picked up. Yeah. Anyway, have a good night. Grand have a good Trooper, night. Atari Spot, I is Post, I Oh, yeah. Else Ground in the Trooper, chat. I is Post, Atari Spot, Lord Monkus. Drexel. Drexel. Who I know is who gone, but is, that's okay. Did he leave? Yeah, yeah he you said gotta he's gotta go. go. Um, and everybody it, who was lurking and yes, not typing. Yeah. Thank we're you for all happy. tuning in. Yeah, oh. Atari's happy. Atari's happy. I'm happy. Everybody out there is happy. Have a good night. Bye. See you on Wednesday. Bye-bye. Now I just have to turn off. There was my mouse. Bye-bye.